So does coffee and caffeine dehydrate you? I get this question all the time. And the short answer is it depends. And so I'm gonna go into a quick study that examined this exact question so you can have a better understanding if coffee and caffeine is dehydrating. So what these group of authors did is they took individuals and they put them on a set diet and a set intake of fluid. So these individuals essentially got about two liters of fluid per day and then combined fluid from both metabolic production and food intake uh, brought it up to a total of 3.2 liters. And so these individuals ended up being in positive fluid balance where the total water intake of 3.2 liters was slightly more than what was lost. And essentially these individuals were in a positive water balance of about 90 mLs or about three ounces. So they were fully hydrated. But then what these individuals did was they replaced six cups of mineral water that they were consuming with six cups of coffee. And we know coffee is a diuretic and that's exactly what happened. The individuals increased urination by about 700 mLs. And what ended up happening is that these individuals were in negative fluid balance by about 0.66 liters, or they were significantly dehydrated when they replaced water with coffee. So in other words, the study says that yes, if you don't increase your fluid intake to match the increase in diuresis, then coffee can absolutely dehydrate you. But it actually gets worse. So coffee isn't just a diuretic where you lose fluid, you actually lose sodium, it's a natriuretic, and you lose potassium, it's a caliuretic, and you actually also lose chloride. So coffee is a salt waster and a potassium waster, and you actually also lose magnesium and calcium a little bit in the urine. So to give you an example of how much, if you consume about four cups of coffee, you lose about a half a teaspoon of salt. In this particular study, since it was six cups of coffee, they actually lost more than a half a teaspoon of sodium or salt. They lost 1,800 milligrams of sodium more over the 24 hours in their urine, consuming six cups of coffee. They also lost over 500 milligrams more of potassium. And coffee causes about a five milligram loss of magnesium. Now that might not sound like a lot, five milligrams of magnesium, but the bioavailability of dietary magnesium is only about 30%. So you need about 15 milligrams of magnesium in the diet more to replace that loss. And then there is some losses of calcium as well, which don't seem to be an issue as long as the calcium intake is about 1,000 milligrams per day. So again, the question is, does coffee or caffeine, is it dehydrating? Well, I would say yes, unless you're replacing the fluid and all the electrolytes that are being lost, and probably most people are not. So be careful with your coffee consumption. I do consume coffee, but I make sure to increase my fluid and electrolyte intakes when I do this.